Hi guys, welcome to my channel. So the name of my channel is called the Quapa Buy. I either buy good crap or bad crap. It's you to decide. So today we're gonna talk about crystals. Everything you need to know about crystals. Like what to, which kind of crystal you should buy. Uh, what you should do with your crystal, what you should not do with your crystals, how to utilize your crystals. So let's dig into it. That's my intro. I don't have a editing software yet. I'm gonna work on it. I'm gonna make my channel super cool. Like I'm just working on it right now, but. Anyway, so let's talk about crystals. I started bought, buying crystals five years ago and I bought an industrial level of freaking crystals. I bought like $2,000 worth of crystals. Like if you guys see my collection, it's like, there's a lot. And then like, if you look at this one, it's worth like 50 bucks. If you want at this one, it's like 60 bucks. If you want like a look at this one, this one was like two bucks. So depending on the crystals, but you know, like 50 bucks, 40 bucks, like, you know, it, it adds up. And that's what like the first thing, first thing you should not do with crystals is to buy a lot of crystals. Like, you know, you don't need this crap. You don't need too much crystals. Like, you know, you see the definition of crystals when you go to crystal shop, you want to buy every freaking crystal that's there because they're all like for you. If you want crystal, first of all, because there's something you need, you need like to help yourself with, with like reducing negative energy to give you more energy to, to get, get more luck. But like, don't get caught by the hype because you can buy those crystals online. That's what I used to do. And I used to just buy, 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 like I normally do. But you know what? You don't need that much crystals. I'm gonna give you guys four crystals that should be on your list. And then at the end of the day, like you can decide like whatever you wanna buy them or not, but at least it's gonna give you a starter kit. Don't buy this stupid starter kit for a chakra. I hate those crystals, they don't shit. You know, one for the, the third eye, it's not even powerful. One for the third eye is called a phenocyte, okay? It's a very powerful crystal. You see, it's like, it's clear. It looks like a quartz crystal, but it's like a super powerful crystal. They always come in small form. I got one, like, it was like big, like, like, like this, like, you know, and it was 50 bucks. They're very expensive, but it works. For me, it works for my third eye. So my intuition, like I'm very good at tarot reading. Uh, every time I feel somebody's energy, they recall me, message me, I hear from them, you know, I, I pick up on energies. Like, you know, I know like this guy's thinking about me because I always feel his energy all the time. And then like this guy calls me, I'm like, oh my God, I knew it. Like, you know, I felt his energy, you know? You feel people energy way more because we have like this energetic system in your body called the chi, but it's like a vibration. It's like a telephone. We pick up somebody's energy, like, you gonna pick up his like telephone number and then like you gotta pick up all his thoughts, all like the negative thoughts you have on your head when you meet somebody toxic, it's from them, not from you. So to clear up the negative energy that you have, use a black tourmalite, okay? This gonna suck up all the bad energy or the positive energy that you don't need. It's gonna suck up all the energy and clear out everything from your, your field. Like you need that because like if you're intuitive like me, you get overwhelmed when you go some places and you just feel everybody's energy and it's just too much in your head. Like, oh my God, I feel everybody. Use a black turn my light, put it around you. There's a trick, there's a way to use crystals. I explained to you guys afterwards I'm done, like the presentation of the crystals you need. So this is very important. Um, also put stickers. I did that with my crystals and then I remove all the stickers. Like I don't even know what does what anymore. Use a sticker. The sticker is gonna tell you exactly which the crystal is and buy the crystal Bible. Like it's a crystal book that tells you everything about crystals. So when you look at it, a black tourmalite, read the definition and that's it, gonna know what it does, you know? Um, and then if you need more energy, this is a moldavite. Basically it's a meteorite that hit the herd and create a crystal, like a, a glass crystal. This is like glass, you know? And this is like the, battery pack of all crystals. They give you so much energy. You're gonna have a firecracker on your butt. Like it's just so powerful. Be careful, it's gonna be overwhelming. When I use this crystal, I feel like I have tinnitus and I feel like woo, woo, woo. I feel like the energy. And this one basically is an alien crystal. It connects you with the universe. It's just like you can develop psychosis. You can develop mental disorder, like, because it's too powerful. You have to be very careful. But if you want more energy and you're really depleted, yeah, use this crystal. 
And then the last one is a rose quartz. The rose quartz, basically, I don't have it. It's like a rose quartz crystal, like it's a quartz with pink. Basically, it's good for love. It affects your love chakra, like your heart chakra, and it gives you like this positive love emotion. I don't want to look at it too much. I prepare myself like usual, and I'm not prepared. Uh, yeah, it's not there. Like, you know, oh, that's the rose quartz. It's pink. It's a pink rose quartz. And then like you 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 wear it with you or like the way I use my crystal, basically if you want to have the full effects, every night put yourself on the side, not, not in the back, not in the front, on the side. And you use your two fingers. You're gonna feel the energy eventually running to your body. It's like a, your chi, your energetic system will 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 absorb the energy of the crystals, and you're gonna get the full effects. I do that every night, and like it was so powerful that I I started having like dry throat, and ringing my ears and thirsty, and I was like, what the hell's going on? Like I'm always on my side, and I don't have this. It was so freaking powerful that I, I just like, I feel like oh, it's coughing. Like it was so powerful because there's like meridians running, like, like ending to your fingers, you know, and there's two here. And then when you use them like this, like you use them on the side, like a little bit on the side, like this, it gonna absorb with your chi and then it's gonna give you more like energy or give you more intuition or give you all the positive effect like effects like absorb the negative energy so to recharge your crystals you need to put them on sunlight people say like in the moonlight or in the water whatever in the moon like in the moonlight and moonlight i don't believe in moonlight i believe in sunlight maybe you guys like in the crystal community came saying like no one likes is powerful i i'd rather the sun it's just my own prerogative i do it every three months like this one i didn't do it for a year like eventually like crystal wear off and the energy is not good because it just connect with everything and then like, it's just like, it's absorb everything and it's just like full of crap inside. You need to recharge it. You need to recharge the crystals. Uh, I got this like pendulum, it's black. And they told me that it could summon like demons. I don't know if it's true. I don't believe in the penalin. Like penalin, basically you use it like this. And then, like, if it turns one way, like it's yes. If it turns the other way, it's no. I don't believe in scrap, you know? I believe in tarot reading. I usually have my crystal close to me when I do tarot reading. This one's supposed to, a psychic, don't be careful with psychics. My God, be careful with psychics. She sold that to me for 300 bucks because I was dealing with like, like bad emotions and I was like very depressed one time in my life. And basically like, she said like, oh, for $300, that's gonna solve all your problems. Doesn't solve your problems. She just took my money, she disappeared. Like when they tell you you have a curse, you don't have a fucking curse. Who tells you you have a curse? Oh, it's gonna take, like, I called this guy for 20 bucks and then he said, oh, you have a curse, it's gonna cost you $600. Like that's how they make the money to remove the curse. Like, I, you don't have curse. Curse doesn't exist. It's all in your mind, it's genjutsu. Genjutsu is like, a, like your mind is fucked. So you need to like release your, your mind and crystal can help you, you know? That's the most powerful crystal in the world. That one was like, $200 is microcuspic crystals and basically it's called a pinfidite and it's like according to this guy on google he did some research about crystals and he found out that this one was more powerful than the earth according like to 100 crystal review uh finicide i like it better that's why i'm wearing with me finicide is the best because it's like number five on his list so and it's cheap well it's cheap it's expensive it's like 50 bucks for like a small nugget but it's, for what it does, it's cheap because it's like, this is like the diamond of the, all the crystals for me. Like, this is the best of the best. Uh, you can get like decorative crystals as well. Like, I like this one. I don't even know what it does anymore. You know, you can have like, this one is pretty cool. I just got it because it's cool, you know. Uh, <coughs> this one, like, you know, you can have decorative crystals, but don't go and buy uh, industrial level crystals because like, you're not gonna use them every night. You just use those three I told you guys about. I'm just like cleaning up because I don't wanna like clean up later on. Uh, I got like this vial, like this like crystals in there too. That was like 80 bucks for one vial. I got like 10 vials that I give it to people. You know, you can give crystal to people. Yeah, that's another thing. If you like part of a crystal community, give a crystal to somebody. 
you know, it just like makes them feel so happy. And it's like, oh, I have a gift for you. I put it in a little box and give them a crystals. People always love crystals. If you're still watching, I'm sure that you want to start your crystal collection and you really want to learn more about them. I know a lot about them, but you know, start with the starter pack, use my technique, put the sticker on it, recharge them, and that's it. And you're gonna you're gonna have some results eventually, you know? It's fun to something to do, it's fun to collect, you look so cool. I love crystals, you know. And it's a good way to pick up a guy. Like one time I gave a crystal to a guy I, I liked and he, like he got all interested in me. Like, oh, you like crystals. Yay! <laughs> so that's the crap I buy. So if you want to put a positive comment, please do. Subscribe, put a like button. If you want to put a negative comment, well, I'm going to summon... Uh, uh, this one is for... Uh, Michael Angel and Michael Angel is gonna come to you and gonna be like, you shouldn't do this. Blah, 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 blah. He's gonna talk shit to you, you know? So yeah, that's pretty much it. So thank you for watching and see you next time for the Quapa Bye. Thank you.